I have a list of names and their corresponding roles in this data set, which is highlighted over here. What I want to do is I want to get a list of unique names for each role in the second column of this table over here. Now it's possible to use the unique formula in Excel in order to get the list of unique values within a list. But what if we want to place a filter or criteria for the unique values? How do we do that? So first I'll display how the unique formula works. So the unique formula exists in all versions of Excel after Excel 2010. So if you're using any of the recent versions of Excel after Excel 2010, this formula is available to you. So all you have to do is, is type unique and then place your range within parentheses. And as easy as that, you get the list of unique values in this range. Now this formula has returned all the unique values in this table over here, regardless of what their corresponding role is. But what if I want to get the unique list based on a criteria? That is, I want a formula which returns the unique names which belong to each of these corresponding roles. I want to know which unique names have the role of actor and which unique names have the role of director. And to do that, I have to make a modification to the unique formula. And here's how it goes. So the formula for that is currently displayed on the screen and I'm going to apply it for each of these roles. That is for the actor role and the director role. And here's how it goes. So I will type unique and open parentheses. Then I will put filter and another open parentheses. Then I will include the array. That is the list from which I want the unique values. And then I will put a comma and then I will select the criteria range, which in this case is this column over here, column D. After I select the range, I will put an equal sign. So I want the criteria to be equal to this value, actor. And close parentheses, and another close parentheses, and then I will click on enter. And as easy as that, we have been able to retrieve all the unique names which have a corresponding role of actor. Now let's do the same for director. So we want to look into this list and get all the unique names which have a corresponding role equal to director. So I'm going to apply the exact same formula to this cell. So I'll go equal sign, unique, open parentheses, filter, open parentheses again, and I will select the array or the list from which I want unique values, comma, I will select the criteria range and I will put an equal sign and I want the criteria range to be equal to directors. So after the equal sign, I will reference this cell over here and another close parentheses and enter. And as easy as that, I was able to ascertain a list of unique values whenever the corresponding role is either actor or director. And it's done using this formula over here. I hope you found this video useful. In my next video, I'm going to show you how to do the exact same thing. However, with multiple criteria. That said, if you got value out of this video, make sure you give it a thumbs up. Also, if you're new to my channel and you haven't subscribed yet, make sure to subscribe and also turn on notifications so you won't miss out on my next videos. See you soon. Bye.